Alright, so the Raptors are switching this down screen here. This player is guarding this player right here. Why is Pascal Siakam double teaming here? Look at this. Now you can't get out to Derek White. He draws help and it leads to an open Celtics uh, little jump shot. Hey, if you are running this kind of ball screen defense, backside help is a non-negotiable. This player here has got to stay here until this player can recover back. If a skip pass is made, then you've got to be able to recover back out. But you can't leave the roll, man. Like, what? Scotty Barnes is doing fine contesting this Jalen Brown jumper right here. What you can't do is leave your feet. Look how you leave your feet. Now it's pump fake right through you. Easy to. Gotta be calling out right now that there's a flare screen coming so that this player knows he's got to get over the top. Instead, you don't. He gets nailed by the flare screen, which causes a late switch. Now Jason Tatum's in the lane, and it creates an open Derek White three. Cannot go east-west if Jalen Brown isn't. Look, at he's not going east-west with this dribble at all. Yeah, look at Scotty Barnes. He's going east-west. So now Jalen Brown blows by you the other way. You're in a zone right now. This Raptors player has got to stay with the Celtics player as he goes to the free throw line. This player's got this player in this area of the zone. But this player doesn't and stands and guards nobody. Look at if I hedge this ball screen right here. Okay, so here's your ball screen. I'm hedging it. Marcus Smart's out of the lane. Where's this player rolling to? The lane is clogged with a backside defender, but nope. Let's just give Marcus Smart the lane. I mean, that's incredibly awful defense. Down screen, come on. You've got to get attached to your man setting this down screen and your arms out so this player can't curl. This player gets to curl, so now it's a two-on-one and it's an alley-oop. What are the Raptors doing here? Pascal Siakam, look at the space that you can get over the screen. What are we even talking about here? You switch for what reason? Not give Jason Tatum wide open threes. Get up and hedge and get him out of here. Backside helps right here. If he throws a skip pass here, I have plenty of time to recover. But you're just giving him a wide open three? You have to communicate and transition. This player's got to say he's got this Celtics player here. So Fred Van Vliet's not going with you. He's going to find somebody else. But you don't communicate. So you have two people guarding one. And at least Hauser open for three. Laziness is the only reason Scotty Barnes does not get back at the same time as Hauser. Look at this. You're just jogging. You're jogging. What is going on here? So, yeah, now you give up a dunk. Can't lean towards the screen. Look at OG Ananobi here. Watch him lean towards the screen that way. That draws a double team. Now this Marcus Smart on the wing can just get it and go right into the lane for two. Okay, you've got to slide with Jason Tatum. Okay, show your hands and slide. When you get handsy with Jason Tatum like this, that's when you instead of just sliding, now you're blown by. This kills you here. Jalen Brown isn't going anywhere with this dribble yet. Watch this Raptors defender. Look at his feet. Now you have no chance of getting over the top of this screen, a screen you should easily be able to get over the top of, and it's going to lead to a Blake Griffin two off a two-on-one. Okay, if you are this Raptors defender here, Fred Van Vliet is guarding the ball just fine. Please go find somebody else to guard. This is a Look at this. is a pointless double team. So now the defense is in scramble mode, and it's just going to be an easy Celtics two again. Stop giving up open jumpers. Look at if I hedge this screen. Where's Blake Griffin going? The backside defender is literally standing right there. But nope, let's give Jalen Brown a practice jumper. You have to defend this down screen first. Fred Van Vliet needs to get attached with his arms out so this player can't curl. Look at when you allow this player to curl. Look at the gargantuan amount of space now. So now there's nothing you can do. It's an open three. This gamble by Scotty Barnes just kills you. Look at this right there. So now Jason Tatum's in the lane that draws a double team and the defense is in scramble mode. Blake Griffin dunk. What is this Raptors player doing? You are guarding this player in the corner. How do you fall asleep on him this much? Look at how much you fell asleep on him. So now it's pump and go. Defense is in scramble mode and it's going to end up in a Jalen Brown layup. Just pathetic. What is going on here? The Raptors are switching this ball screen. So what is this player doing here all the way over in backside help? Now you can't get to your man in the corner, so Jason Tatum can just pump and go right by you for a layup. Have to be level to the screener if you're switching right now. Way up here, level to the screener. You are not ready to switch, so now you're out of position. And now Jason Tatum is going to dust you for two.
You cannot lean towards a cross screen. Look at this player here. Look at him leaning towards this cross screen right here. Whoops, Jason Tatum is now going over a down screen that you have now no chance of guarding. Okay, this is good. Stay up with Jalen Brown. Why are you backpedaling backwards? See that backpedal backwards? Now you're not going to get over the top of this handoff. So two people have to go to the ball. The defense is in scramble mode. Easy Jalen Brown dunk. Can't guard Jason Tatum like this. Look at this player's feet. you got to get your feet level to one another. When you get open up your hip like this, now this step back three is possible. Don't get back to the middle of nowhere in transition like this player. You get to a body. There's Marcus Smart, somebody. Guard one of these players. Nobody ends up guarding Marcus Smart because that player is just standing in no man's land. This is good. You're in a defensive stance with your feet set. This is not good. Look at look at right here. Look at you jump up to have to guard Marcus Smart. So now he's going to blow by you, and this step back three is available. For switching a screen, you have to get underneath the screener right now, and Fred Van Vliet's got to get level to the screener so he can guard the ball. None of those things happen here. So Jason Tatum's wide open on his roll. You can't switch a ball screen like this. Look at this right here. Look at the space. You've got to be leveled to the screener. You are not ready to guard. So Marcus Smart explodes right past you for two. Look at if I hedge this ball screen right here, okay? So right now I'm hedging. This gives this player a lot less time needed to be in backside help on this player's roll. When you give Jalen Brown the lane, now this player has infinite time to roll. If you want to play in the gaps here, you cannot bring your feet inward. Watch Scotty Barnes here. Look at his feet. They're going inward. So now you have no chance of getting back to the corner. So it's pump and go right in the lane for two. What is Thaddeus Young doing here? You are standing in no man's land. If you're guarding the ball, get up and guard the ball. Look at this. What are you doing? So now Derek White's in the lane, draws a double, dunk. You are guarding Jalen Brown. Because you become lazy about guarding Jalen Brown, watch this. You're going to get screened by your own freaking guy. So now you can't get out to Jalen Brown who can just pump and go right into the lane for an easy two. Unbelievable. What is happening here? Scotty Barnes is easily over the top of the screen. Yet why are two people guarding the ball right now? So now Jalen Brown's wide open. Pump fake and go, collapse the defense again, and again it just results in an open three. If this player's going under the screen, then he's going under the screen and you're staying with the screener. Look what happens. Two people end up guarding the ball again. So now you're late to get out to Jalen Brown who can just hit you with a jab step and an open three. Can't switch like this. You have to be level to the screener so you're ready to guard. You try and switch. Now Jalen Brown schools you is in the lane and one.